Hi, this is a video to show you how we can use the Ultrix Connectors for SAP solutions from DVW Analytics to extract data directly from SAP, enhance it and prepare it, ready to load into Auto Insights from Ultrix, which in turn uses AI to create analyses of your data within minutes, including dynamic dashboards and root cause analysis. Let's see then how we can apply this revolutionary tool to our SAP data. Firstly, we use the DVW Analytics tools in Alteryx to extract data from SAP. Next, we prepare that data so it's ready for ingestion into the Auto Insights solution. And then we can use the power of Alteryx to bring data from other sources if necessary to enhance and cleanse that data. Finally, we load the data up into Auto Insights to let it do its magic. Here's a workflow that does exactly that. And you can find this workflow in the Alteryx community gallery if you search for DVW. The four containers correspond to the four steps in the process. Extraction, preparation, enhancement and load. Let's start with extraction and you can see that I have the add-in from DVW Analytics loaded to my designer. That gives me many options to extract data from SAP. That could be from T codes, from BW reports, from HANA views, etc, etc. But today I'm going to use a table extraction. If you look at the first container, you can see we've used two of these tools to extract SAP billing data from the header table and then from the line item table. Here's the header table. You can see that we can select exactly which output we're interested in, in terms of the columns, and we can filter exactly on what we want. This can be done either inside the tool, or if we use an input, in this case a text input, we can control the data externally, but from within Alteryx. As you can see, we're choosing a range of dates. We're going to choose that header date and we're going to pass it through a filter tool, which in turn will pull the line items exactly as we want them from SAP. Here's the line item table within SAP. Again, we've selected the fields we want. When we run this, we then just join using the standard Alteryx join tool to bring the full picture, the header and the line items or segment level together. OK, now we have the SAP source data, we can move on to the next step, which is to prepare the data set for ingestion into Auto Insights. This just involves using standard Alteryx tools to tidy and cleanse the data and to present data in the correct data types. For instance, we need a recognizable date field in order to drive the time series analysis within Auto Insights. In the next section, we enhance the data. For instance, we could use SAP text data to replace the technical values that SAP provides with more descriptive values. These can come from SAP, as we see here, or from text files, or indeed any other source. Finally, we pass that data using a load tool up into the Auto Insights engine. We just need to define our data set within our Auto Insights instance and then run the flow to pass the data in. Let's start that process. So firstly, you can see the data being extracted from the SAP tables. This starts with those text tables, but then quickly moves on to the header table for the billing data. You can see 10,000 rows have been extracted and we pass those via that filter tool into our line item table. And you can see that the line items are extracted in batches. This is a really efficient and effective way to pull that data from the table. They're joined to create around 16,000 lines and we're going to pass those through preparation and enhancement stages and finally up into the Auto Insights engine. It takes a few minutes just for that to run and analyze the data, but very quickly we can have our data ready for viewing over on the Auto Insights platform. If we switch across now to the Auto Insights console, we can see that our data set has landed. And if we open the data set, we can see that automatically dashboard type analysis has been provided for us. But we can switch between different measures. We can change the comparisons. We can look at filtering and digging into the data. Also, we can look at root cause or 80-20 analysis, which is built in automatically in plain English text. Hopefully you can see the power of this, bringing SAP data directly into an AI dynamic dashboard. There really is nothing like this on the market that allows all levels of users to extract and analyze data automatically at the touch of a button. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see more, please visit our website at dvwanalytics.com. Thank you.